Hey guys, my name is Leafies and welcome back. Uh, there's a reason I'm not playing Minecraft, and you know, it just wouldn't be appropriate for this topic, I guess. Video call this game is called Brawl Hollow, by the way. It's free on Steam. It's super fun. I recommend you check it out. I'm the wolf guy. You can probably already tell. I'm just doing an offline tournament for the, you know, content. Anyway, so today I'm going to talking about Lawcraft and my reasons for resignation. So yeah, let's get right into it. So, Lawcraft, if you don't know, is, well, I'm pretty sure you do know if you watch my video, my, my channel actively, you would know that Lawcraft is the survival series on my channel. It's like a realm with like, I don't know, 20 other, nah, no, that's an exaggeration, 12 other people, I think, and they all play survival together and make shops. It's kind of like Hermitcraft, but with smaller people, and if you, you might even know that was a series. But did you know that it is the worst performing series on the channel? And I'm not saying that's why I want to leave. That's 100% my fault. My commentary isn't interesting enough. Like, Mumbo Jumbo and Green, they find so, they put, like, just as an example, they put so much humor into their videos. And you can tell they're enthusiastic and there are some bland parts, but. That's what the best green moments are for. Uh, there are some bland parts, but overall their content is quite entertaining and they find ways to spruce it up around every corner of the video. Do videos even have corners? Now, this entertainment skill is something that I lack and it's blatant because while all my other series is get like, you know, 300 views minimum, Lockcraft peaks at like 100 and that's about it for each video. Now, I'm not saying I quit Lawcraft because views are low, but I am saying that the views prove that not many people are interested in the survival aspect. More people watch Server Sunday, or Tech Tuesday, or Fun Friday, and of course the Hermitcraft ones, but I'm going to leave those out. And not enough people watch Lawcraft, which is obviously a flaw with me. So the first reason is me. That's reason number one. Reason number one is that I'm just not entertaining enough. I think the main reason for reason number one is that I just lost motivation. I don't know why I know this happens, and I am sorry if you legitimately enjoyed the series, but I have just lost all motivation for playing on Lawcraft. And the f next two reasons, they're kind of the reason for this loss of motivation, but it just doesn't feel like a genuine Minecraft experience. And don't worry, because I have a solution. But regardless, I'm going to be one of those terrible YouTubers that keeps you watching till the end. So you're going to have to watch till the end, or just kind of skip till the end till you find the solution. Sorry about that. I don't feel that I'm providing you guys with enough good content, because, I don't know, something about Lawcraft. And so hopefully, I can better improve myself with the solution at the end of the video, which is going to compensate for all of this. Reason number two is time. Lawcraft, of course, is full with many talented people, and they're working every day to get their stuff done. And I don't know how old the oldest one is, like, I'm not really sure, but one thing that I do know, and that maybe you know, is that I'm going into high school this year. So this September, my high school year begins, and it's going to require quite a bit. I'm going to have to work much harder than I did in middle school. And because Lawcraft is a multiplayer realm, I don't feel like I contribute enough. Everyone's out here gonna have these massive builds, and here I am, getting on once per week. And like, this is a problem with the content as well. I don't have enough time to make the quality Let's Play content. If, I, if I'm gonna make a Let's Play series, I wanna be it on my own terms, and that is the reason that I just feel like I'm gonna disappoint everyone else if I spend no time playing Lawcraft, because playing Lawcraft actively, like the very beginning of season one, or at the very beginning of season two actually, I grinded resources. I spent hours on Lawcraft server. And with high school going around five days a week and math school on Saturday, so six days a week of school, like I have to, I'm not gonna have any time to record the high quality in air quotes content that you guys deserve and I'm not gonna be able to live up to the multiplayer you know the multiplayer bar I can't reach that bar because I don't have enough time to work towards it so that's reason number two moving on to reason number three I really 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 didn't want to bring reason number three into this 
However, it is, of course, toxicity. The Lawcraft community was pretty chill in season one, with about six YouTubers, I think, maybe. One of them never even went on, but the rest, Leo, Connor, Osu, me, Cave. I'm gonna feel so bad if I'm forgetting someone, <laughs> crap. But the community was really nice, we were all really friendly, everyone was chill, and there was absolutely nothing. It was just peaceful with very little people. And now, there are, it's like almost tripled the player count. So it's like there's like 15 members, I think. And don't get me wrong, some of them are nice. Like, very many people on the Lovecraft server are nice. Um, let me give you an example. Digital Smile 959 produces high quality content. Actually, all of them do. Digital Smile 959, super nice. Uh, respect him. That one Lime, obviously I know him in real life, but he's super nice as well, and he's chill. However, two things are kind of going on with the player community, which, you know, I... I don't want to say I don't like because that makes me feel like a douche and I don't want to come across as that. But there's two things that, you know, just make me feel a bit uncomfortable. So the first thing makes me kind of uncomfortable to talk about, but of course it's the age range. Um, I know people who are around my age, like I assume Legendary is, or I know that one Lime is, Pebble the Cat is like one year younger than me. But there are some people that like are seriously younger than me. Like this is not something that I find a bad quality. It's just I don't have these good qualities in myself to bond with said people. Like, if I kill one of them, I'm going to feel so bad, or they might take it the wrong way. And that's not their fault, it's my fault, but I'm just not experienced enough with dealing with people who are, like, three years or two years younger than me. I mean, even Cave, who I'm pretty sure is, like, one year younger than me, calls me a freaking monkey orphan baby. What? I Yes, it's a joke, but... What the hell? How do you want me to interpret this? Like, seriously, he goes into the Q&A and he says, Do you have TikTok? I bet you do, you monkey orphan baby. What? And still, will you accidentally delete all the questions again? That was forced, mate. And then he says, get nannied on you little nugget pickle baby. I'm so confused. You weefies monkey pickle that is weefies, but also pickle and monkey and monkey and monkey and weefies and monkey and pickle, which is pickle and weefies. I bet do you believe in giraffes? I bet you do believe you normie boomer. What? I'm so freaking confused. And then, even further, goes with the bot. Weefies is a monkey orphan nugget baby. Weefies is a monkey of weefies is a nugget orphan baby. Cool. Another thing. Okay, I'm just playing my Lawcraft. I'm playing calmly. I'm building my base. Common vids and KYT, they're in a call. They rehearse this. Why aren't you in Asia yet? Eating a dog. I mean, yeah, it's a joke, but... Like, what the heck? Uh, I mean, I just said uh, my sense of humor isn't developed enough to understand this. The problem is with me, obviously. It's not with them, it's with me. But it's still a problem, even though it's with me. So clearly, something's amiss that I'm just not getting, right? You guys might find this funny, but I just don't understand this. I mean, is it is it cool to just... What? Never mind, moving on. Reason number two. <laughs> There's a second problem with the community that I really hate discussing, but it's inevitable. It's force plays. Now, don't get me wrong here. Force plays isn't a bad guy. If anything, he's misunderstood. But there's so many people in the Logcraft server that just send so much toxicity towards him. And it's just so uncomfortable for me. Because I don't know whose side to take. And so I just, you know, watch. Forest Place isn't a bad guy. But you guys can see for yourself. Like, for some reason, everyone has so much against him. Like, in this thing, you guys can see on screen right now. Uh, let me just find it. Yeah, here it is. You guys can see on screen. Force, you don't have to be rude to be in charge or control a bot to back up your claims. I have a simple thing to say. Why do you have to be mean to me for notifying the few people who actually watch my videos that the rate they'll be released and will be slowing down due to school? Like, seriously, bro. That was awful. Sorry for eating that. That was so weird. The fact that you have to hate on me for actually caring to my small clump of viewers shows that you suck. I agree with Darth. 
So if you guys don't know the context, which I'm 100% sure you don't, unless you're a Lawcraft member, then you'll know that, then you, then I'll explain. So Fourth Place pretty much used a bot to call Darth Cash's content cringy, stop using your face cam, people will cringe. And LCM, Darth Cash, so Fourth Place said this, Darth Cash, you don't understand, how you don't understand the joke? I don't hate you, and I don't suck, the bot part was so jokey. See man, he's just trying to make a joke, like... Calling someone cringy, it's just a joke, bro. And yeah, like, you would know that I made the vote bot say that. Everyone can make the bot say what they want. Now, even though the bot can be, like, used to say whatever it wants, it literally doesn't mean it should. But still. So jokey. So, I guess he his interests come from the right place. So he's not mean, I think. So, Forest Blaze runs my Discord server, and he does a good job, or at least a job, of doing it. And, because I'm not even that active, and he does actually a really nice job maintaining the server, at least, you know, updating it and such. But, look at the Q&A. 98. Force is an abuser. We reached 111 questions, and then Force purged them all? Banned Force? I deleted the questions to end the Force banned thing. So, Math later told me this was a whole thing as a joke. But Force Plays being, quote, mad with power, as I heard people tell me in DMs, a lot of people are complaining to me that just Force should be banned or demoted. And to be honest, I just, it makes me so uncomfortable. Like, yeah, they're my people who are on the Discord server, but Force Plays also runs the Discord server. He's like, he even has more power than me, I think. Um, if anything, I can ever make my own Discord server, like, without him, but... He's not doing like awful things. Maybe he's deleting questions or being toxic towards people. But I mean, yeah, he's he's just joking. See this right here? We need to cover what he's base. It'll take nine hundred hours to clean up. That's a joke. I mean, see, he's just joking around. <laughs> um, and this is just a thing that you can't just say anything and say that's a joke. It reminds me of all those things like it's just a prank, bro. Oops, shot you in the chest. Just a prank, bro. Oops, your mom's fat. That's so jokey. I mean, you can't just say whatever you want and then say it's a joke and expect people to write it off as irrelevant. Because that's just plain rude. And second of all, I just don't want... I don't know why this is. This is just kind of petty. But Force Plays once said I was wrong, so look at this conversation. I want to join Lockcraft, and I admire our friends and one of the members of Weefy's video. And in Weefy's video, sorry I read that awfully, it said I can bypass all the requirements to join. Is that true? I think so. So I will be able to join mid-season, but you still gotta wait one year. You can't join mid-season, sadly. Oh, because in Weefy's video, it says you can join mid-season. He gets a lot of stuff wrong. Always. I always have to point out stuff what he did wrong. What the actual hell? I'm not wrong. Okay, that sounds like <laughs> that sounds, sounds so weird, but well, look at this. A few days earlier, Force Plays wrote this: "You can't join mid-season. This doesn't apply to special people, IRL friends of members." What? I, 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 I you, you guys can clearly see. There is literally he said it himself. This doesn't apply to special people. And then cave, right underneath. We will have two, one to two potential new people joining Lockcraft. They are epic friends, so they will join. That one lime, common vids, beef stew, so many other nice people joined mid-season because they know the members IRL. I'm right. I'm right. I'm right. There's no denying it now. I'm 100% correct in my claim. But in seriousness... Force plays might do some wrong stuff, but as far as I can tell, most of his intentions come from protecting his ego and helping others. He didn't want he thought Darth Cash's video was cringy, so he told him so he wouldn't make the same mistake again. He wanted to end the banned force thing so people wouldn't think of him as a bad guy. I don't know how I'm supposed to respond to this. It's just so uncomfortable. And I guess that's one of the biggest reasons that I want to leave, because it's I have no idea what I'm supposed to be doing. I can't take sides. I'm not going to be mean to force. I'm not going to tell the locker members they're wrong. 
Because I depend on Forest Place to run my Discord server. Or to run his Discord server that he named for me. That's how he sees it anyway. So, I'm going to leave two polls for you guys. The first one is, do you want me to make a new Discord server? Just mine. No Force, just my own Discord server. It might suck more, but it's mine. So, leave your thoughts on the poll in the like, card right there. Now, um, I will leave Lawcraft. This is like a final decision thing. And what can I do to compensate? Well, something that's my own time schedule and no toxic people. I found the solution. You know the hardcore option of Minecraft? We're going to make a hardcore Let's Play. Kind of like PewDiePie. If I die, series is over. It's kind of a chill thing. I can't die, so I'm going to be much more relaxed while playing. And hopefully it's going to be much more fun. I'll try to make it more interesting for you guys. I'll try to do things that are cute instead of just massive redstone projects. Get animals. I can't think of another reason. <laughs> but... Or another thing. But, yeah. If you guys want a hardcore Let's Play, just me. Chill. And maybe a bit more fun. No huge redstone. I don't want to die. So, yeah. Go into the poll in the top right again. And vote. Yes, hardcore. Or no, hardcore. I'll do what you guys want. This is just compensation for the survival aspect of Minecraft. So, yeah. That's my resignation. I'm sorry that I sound like a douche throughout this whole video. Or that I sound like a petty kid or spoiled or something. And I'm really sorry if it did come across that way. I didn't intend. I just have to get all this stuff off my chest. Because it's been bothering me for a really long time. So, thank you all for watching. I'm not going to ask for a like, but drop a like. And I'll see you all next time. Adios, amigos. Peace.